Anyway, let's get into this game. What's good guys, uh, extra O here. I'm just gonna commentate the end of this set before I have to go up and play doubles. Right now we have crusty ass Tims and Silvio versus Duramgar and King Arc. These are two, I would say roughly even match teams. Uh, crusty ass Tims and Silvio being around the same skill level of like those upper high uh, mid players that you know are like really good and can make a big upset but aren't quite like PR level yet. Um, and then we have Duramgar and King Arc. Duramgar, uh, not quite at the same level as the other three people competing, but that does not mean he cannot put up a fight. Uh, he's been improving a lot lately, I've been seeing it in his play. He's being a bit more patient, being a little bit less uh, antsy with his movement stuff, you know. Uh, Ness can get in a habit of just kind of pressing a lot of buttons, but he's been getting a lot more patient. And then King Arc, uh, very well known Mega Man. Um, 
extremely high level player, in my opinion, PR level. Uh, he just needs to go a little bit further and he's going to be seen as a top threat. He's an amazing player. Um, and right now we have them up game one. I saw some fumbles from uh, from crusty ass Tims. He got edge guard a lot, did too many committal options while the other opponent was right there. And that led him to him getting killed really early. Uh, I saw him getting back air, I saw him getting dared. I saw him getting F smashed by King Arc a lot of times or Duramgar with the back airs. I saw him hit him a lot. So Krusty has him, he has to be careful to not overcommit when punishing in an option. Like you can get a punish, but you gotta be really quick with it, especially with a character like Piranha Plant. And you got you just gotta not go for too much because it's doubles and you can die for that. Uh, another thing really important is um, all right, I saw one good thing I saw I saw Silvio he was really keen on getting his back airs to pick up from where Duran, uh, where Krusty Estens left off so I think they're good in the synergy when it comes to killing it does need to work on the defensive play a bit and I like this switch to to Game Watch Krusty Estens at this point he kind of co-mains plant and Game Watch I know he must be really fun at parties um, so he like um yeah, he, I would say Game Watch is his strongest character though, and but I think it's going to be a way better pick. He can be way less committal, get way better damage, be a great support. It's just so much better of a character than uh, Piranha Plant, and I think this could actually result in a huge shift. Okay, quick damage right there. Uh, the Ramgar picking up off of the uh, King Arc's up smash. Oh wow! Beautiful parry, knowing the fair's gonna come in and the amazing reaction. That sucks. The back air actually gonna take out both uh, his teammate and Dara. Still, I'd say a worthwhile trade though. Oh, King Arc missing the tech, and that's going to even things up after a really rough start. Already back into this extremely even right now. Now it's slightly King Arc just has not been able to get hit this whole game. Ooh, really good read from Dar right there, knowing that he was gonna go for a long option and held that out. Probably thinking he was gonna spot dodge, but that works out too. Oh Krusty has him going for the kill right now. He's fiending for it because he really wants to even this up, which is a good idea, but he has to be careful to not let this lead get further. And King Arc just playing amazing right there. Just Silvio has not been able to touch him in the 1v1 at all. King Arc still only at 35%. They're just gonna have to really make sure that Krusty Ass Tims does not lose the stock soon. And somehow get it to maybe a 2v1 against King Arc. Maybe focus on Dara. At 81%, something could get the stock right now, but Mega Man's still very heavy. both had so much percent. This is such a rough position. And this will be a miracle if Silvio can bring this back. It's looking very unlikely. Not just because it's a 2v1, but King Arc's just been untouchable. And that's gonna close it out. Okay, that was a very brief one-game commentary from Extra O. Now, I have to play on stream, so wish me luck, fellas.